Hello everyone, in this video we will see how we can create a cover letter for job applications. So let's begin with the video. First let us see what is cover letter. Actually a cover letter is basically a document which we will be sending along with, you, with our resume, uh, resume or CV when we are applying for job. It just acts as an introduction uh, and like uh, it helps us to tell the employer that why we are the best candidate for the job. This is one of the latest uh, videos of uh, what to add in your cover letters. So no need of uh, searching for anywhere else. You can directly see this video and create your own cover letter. So let's look what should cover letter contain. It should contain opening, reason for writing, introduction, why you are the best fit, closing comments and signing off. So we will see all these further. So the first thing is we will open a blank word file and then we will go to page layouts and set the margin to 1.25 in top, bottom, left and right and click on OK and we will go to the size and make it as A4 and we will go to the home back and make the font as Calibri body the first thing we will be writing is the date and after the date we will be writing the opening that is you can write as dear sir or madam or you can uh, even write as dear and you can write the recruiter's name like dear Sachin or something. Okay, this will be the opening of our cover letter. The next section is uh, why you are writing this cover letter for example uh, I am writing this cover letter to apply for a particular position for now I have written as I am writing uh, this cover letter to uh, express my interest in the position of business development executive you can similarly write for your similar position so this will be the reason uh, why you are writing this cover letter coming to the next section that is introduction introduction is basically you give a brief introduction of yourself for example currently in which company you are working in and what role you are working in and you can also mention your past experience like uh, past which company you have worked and what position you have worked and if you are a fresher uh, no need of mentioning the experience part like for example if you have an internship you can mention it but if you don't have any you can directly write like what studies you have completed like uh, you have completed your masters or uh, bachelors in a particular institution with particular marks or else you can mention uh, like uh, the languages you know or any uh, information that adds value to your introduction if you are not getting how to write you can also pause your screen and read what i have written so that you will get some idea of what you can write in your cover letter introduction so that's all about the introduction. Make sure your introduction is brief and precise. The next section is why you are fit for this role. In this section you, ha you have to write why you are suitable for this particular job position. Like you can write about your previous experience that you have experience in that particular role and you can uh, contribute largely taking the experience from the previous company or if you don't have any experience like you can write you are a friendly and an enthusiastic worker like you are very keen on working and exploring this particular field all those things you can be writing and you can also look look at what I, I have written to get an idea of what you can write in your cover letter uh, section The next part is uh, closing comments. In the closing comments, you generally tell thank you for taking time uh, to read your cover letter or you, you will be give, uh, giving information about like at what time you will be available for a particular interview or like uh, you can even give your contact information for them to contact like your uh, phone number uh, or else your email ID. Uh, this is also an important section you have to add this because it uh, shows that you are showing some respect to the uh, person who, who is uh, giving you the empl employment. Uh, so this is all about the closing comments. 
coming to the last part that is signing off in the signing of you will be writing like uh, a sentence like i'll be looking forward to uh, hearing from you and uh, you can write as uh, in the below that you are sincerely and in the below you can write your name so in the below you have to write your name in the above in the opening section you have to write the employer's name or you can write as dear sir or ma'am these two things you can remember so this is about the signing off so this is all about the cover letter after writing the cover letter make sure the format is uh, proper and uh, give proper space so that uh, the cover letter is uh, readable and also make sure uh, that there are no spelling mistakes because uh, uh, like if when the rec uh, when the recruiter sees your cover letter he doesn't he shouldn't get a, a wrong impression by seeing the typos and make sure all the format is correct and yeah you can see that how I, i have given all the margin spaces so that it is more readable uh, and gives a good impression to the recruiter make sure before uh, sending this cover letter to the uh, employer that uh, you are converting it into pdf because uh, if you send in word format uh, the format uh, uh, sometimes get messy so uh, you have to convert this into pdf and you can convert it into pdf uh, from here export to pdf okay you can convert and then you can look that uh, your cover letter looks proper so you can contact me if you need a cover letter you can find my uh, contact information in the comment section or description and uh, if you can create by yourself you can watch this video and create by yourself so thank you for watching this video make sure you subscribe the channel and like and share the video with the with your friends as well so thank you